every year, travelers across the country hit the roads or the skies over the holidays to be with loved ones. However, with the continuous winter storm, not all has gone according to plan. Valley News Team's Kellen Harmon was at Hector Airport today and spoke with scrambling travelers. In the season of giving, people expect gifts, laughs, and if traveling, a bit of a headache. But for holiday flyers, that headache was bigger than they were expecting. My flight is 6 o'clock in the morning. I had to wait three days to get a flight. Five days later than I was supposed to be there, I'll get there. The first uh, cancellation was because of the weather. The rest, everything because of operational failure. Travelers say they experienced delay after delay for various reasons. Thursday morning, come here for the airport, my 2 o'clock flight. Got on the plane around 6 or 7. Fly to Dallas, got up there about 15 minutes, the, the plane was leaking fuel. Almost four hours on the plane. They came to de-ice us, they got about three-fourths of the way around, and the de-icer iced up or malfunctioned of some sort. And some even had to change their Christmas plans. There are several other passengers who don't have an option. They're stranded here, like we have celebrated Christmas together in the airport. We're kind of becoming a little family here. We kind of know each other now because we've been with each other for 24 hours. For some, it's changed their future travel plans. Others see it as just the way it is. I was supposed to fly out yesterday, but still I'm stranded here. I'm going to cancel my flight and go back to my home, Bismarck, and fly out from there. I'm cool with it. I'm not, not upset. I'm just um, tired of waiting, you know, for five days to leave. It's all good. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not happy, but I'm not sad. In Fargo, Kellen Harmon, Valley News Live. While some were under, understandably frustrated, the travelers we spoke with say they appreciate how the staff handled the delays.